McGovern knocks it out long to Woodcock. And he skips away from Gerda. Over to his left is Battles. The first time shot on the near post. That's the speed of the Forest breakout. That was good stuff by Tony Woodcock. Looks to his left, picks up Bertels, and Bertels does the right thing. The first time shot, but wide by Glovans. Here's Muller. Van Gaal making a run diagonally to his right. Van Gaal now marked up. And the return ball for Muller. Off. Scoring chance there, and Forrest were all over the place. That's the clearest ch chance of the game. This 1-2 ball with Van Gaal, and Muller was in there. Forrest was static, the goal was open, and he's wide. And through ball for Glovatz. Glovatz being chased by Needham, that's a good ball into Van Gaal. Good drive, and a goal, yes! Van Gaal, and that is a dramatic goal. A crusher for Nottingham Forest. One thing that Hannes Weissweiler, their manager, came here with pin for was one goal. Van Gaal's got it. Nobody picked up Van Gaal. He was free. He triggers the right foot. Shilton got a touch onto the post, and it trickles into the nest. Borussia Mönchengladbach player. Four times cap for West, West Germany. Here's Woodcock. And once again, Cologne break and the long striding. Herbert Newman has looked and finds Van Gaal. And he's all right. It's one against one. Van Gaal against Schulten. And now it's Muller to score goal number two. Oh, my goodness me. Forrest are in real trouble. Two nothing down at home. They look at the linesman. They ask for the offside flag. It didn't come. But they've only themselves to blame there. Initially for leaving Van Gaal. Here it was one on one. And Van Gaal drags Shilton from his goal. The square ball, and nothing is going to stop Muller scoring there. Ping! His fifth goal in European Cup matches this season. They put two past them. Here goes Boya. Bertels. Woodcock. The shot from Boya. Oh, beauty! Hit the bar! That was such a beautiful bench shot. Oh, we've got the slow-mo of that last shot. Boya bent it perfectly, like a banana, hit the bar, should have been a goal. Needham and Lloyd in the box, the corner taken. Boya off to Robertson. Needham, and then he's looking for Battles. And that was a beautiful goal from Gary Battles. In the same net that he scored his first European Cup goal against Liverpool, has dragged Forrest back into the game. 2-1 now to Cologne. This ball from Robertson, a beautiful knock ball back from Needham. And Gary Bertels found the space and the coolness to pop that ball away from Schumacher. And again, a beautiful ball out of defence by Cologne. It's Kanopka. Muller is free over the far side. Has he seen him? Yes, he has. Van Gaal is there with him. Konopka is still in the attack. Good drive. Good save. But Cologne only had three men forward then. Konopka was one of them. Muller looks up, sees Konopka, who started the attack, coming in still. This drive was on target. Shilton had to save it. Bertels. Taking on Schuster, beats him. McGovern, Gemmel, McGovern, good drive. Now that's more like it, Nottingham Forest. They put that one together, that was their young captain, John McGovern, who was involved. John McGovern, Gemmel, the one two, and McGovern bang on target. Schumacher had to make the save. Gemmel, Woodcock. And he's beaten Zimmerman again, but they close down on him. He's in there. Oh, and that hit. Schumacher's right boot. What a beautiful bit of skill, though, by Tony Woodcock. He slips one marker, slips another one, in with a half chance, hits it, and it hit the goalkeeper. That's Needham across. McGovern trying to get there, but Van Gaal will be first. 
Muller hits this one for Van Gogh. And he's all on his own again. Archie Gummel comes to him. He checks. Has a look. He's in for a chance. Oh, and he's just wide. And he holds his head in his hands. But Van Gogh had the settling of it there. All on his own. He checks, looks up. Outside of the right boot, and that didn't miss the outside of the post by more than inches. And Glovatz turns out of trouble against Robertson and gives the ball immediately to McGovern. Now Robertson with a chance really to go at the Cologne defence. The chip. Bertels knocks it down. And Boya scores the goal. Beautifully constructed goal for Ian Boya. This man of all parts, man of all seasons. Superb stuff by Boris that's got that crowd roaring. It's 2-2. Look at this for a cross ball from Robertson. Look at the honesty of Bertels up to get the knockdown and the deadly accuracy of Ian Bowyer to score the equaliser. McGovern and Robertson facing Glovatz with Knopka in support. There's Woodcock. Woodcock and Zimmerman. Number three trying to prevent him getting a turn in. Woodcock shielding that ball. And he stubs it in, and it just didn't have the length. A missed kick. McGovern! Oh! What an incredible save, and what rotten luck on John McGovern. What superb goalkeeping. That ball dropping from Muller. A free gift to McGovern. A shot bang on target. A superb save by Schubert. No thoughts of uh, looking for a third at this moment. Here's Woodcock, McGovern, there goes Bertels. Turn, shoots, oh, it was great, and a superb goal, John Robertson. What a fantastic goal by John Robertson. 3-2 Nottingham Forest, 17 minutes into the second half. Oh, you won't see much better than that. Well, that, that sums it up. Look at the work by Gary Bertle, though. A blistering cross, and here comes Robertson, full length. Goalkeeper's got no chance. Oh, superb stuff. Neymar. For Van Gogh. And this is always dangerous. As he goes in against Barrett, and Van Gogh is there again. The touch-off for Neumann. Oh, this man Van Gogh is posing all kinds of problems for Nottingham Forest. That time, the wriggling run away from Barrett. There's a wild tackle from Needham. The ball squared back for Neumann. That could so easily have been buried for number three, but it's over the bar. Hopefully we'll see some time wasting by Cologne if they can. Lloyd. Or on to Muller. And Muller could get one here. Oh. just shows you you cannot relax for one second against Cologne, the West German champions. Really wasn't anything on, just a long ball through from Kuhlmann. Muller gets on the end of it. Shilton commits himself solidly. Puts Muller off on the balls over the bar. Bertels across and Lloyd in. And McGovern trying to win this back. But Muller knocks it off for Van Gogh. It's one-on-one -on -one at the moment. Van Gogh and Okadira. Is this going to be dramatic? His first touch. Oh, yes it is. Oh my goodness me. What a way to come on as a substitute. And that man Van Gogh did it again. Oh, Padera. Well, you can't do anything better than that. What an incredible moment. For the first time in his career here at the Forest Ground, Shelton's beaten by three goals. The ball in from Van Gogh, Okudera, the touch, and ping. And it's 3-3, and Shilton was over it and missed it. Boya. Clark has, uh, Barrett has started to run the ball into O'Neill, and a ba Barrett! Trying to make certain. Boya it was, who spotted the fullback making the run. Barrett does a, 
a knock-in to O'Neill. And now here comes Barrett, takes it away from the goalkeeper, but couldn't get it towards the target. Cologne's eyes all fixed on referee Garrido. They're waiting for that whistle. There it is. So Cologne, who came here and felt that if they got beaten but scored just one goal away from home, have done a lot better than that. They took a 2-0 lead. Forrest pull back to 2-2. Forrest in front at 3-2. And then a Japanese substitute, Okadera. Well, look at the smiling face there of Okadera. Well, that really is a tremendous mountain now left for Forrest to climb in the European Cup if they're to go to the final in Munich on May the 30th.